Alright guys, back with part 20, and like I said, I did a lot of grinding off-screen. Not only did I get the Apollo card, but level 37 now. Yeah, there's two areas in the game where you really want to grind. The arena, and right here, after you beat death. I mean, you get dropped off in here anyway, and these two assholes show up, and they give you a lot of experience points. Here we go, we leveled up again. Not only that, these Grizzlies, they drop two items you really want. One is a strength ring, I think you saw me get that already. Double whammy. And they'll drop spiced meat, which gives you a hundred hit points back. In fact, let me see, how many of those did I manage to nab? Three. There, so now I actually got recovery items to speak of. So yeah, there is a bit of grinding involved in Circle of the Moon, like I said, and not just for the cards. When you just do it for hit point, I mean experience points, that's where you want to do it. He, back there, and in the arena. Fucking bats. But still, the amount of detail in the wings. <sighs> they say that Super Castlevania 4 has sold a lot of Super NESs, but... It's safe to say that this game sold a lot of Game Boy Advances. Hit him already! Stop kotoing to me, Barbarian. Okay, magic back up. Okay, that one area off on the right, I still think you need to fly to get to it, but... No, don't change card combo yet. So for now... There's a couple more things in here I can get before I move on to the next area. One hit now, but I already got your card, so... You have no further use to me. You guys, however... Oh, trying to web me up, trying to do that Spider-Gwen shit. Uh, I don't think so, bitch. Ah, oh, she got me again. Yeah, I just kind of nudged you in the middle of your leg with my foot. Death by slight touching with my foot. Okay. He feels only 20, but I'll, I'll take it. Every little bit helps. Now, yeah, we gotta do this shit again, so... Mercury? Cockatrice? Let's do it. Don't! This is probably something I should do when I get the flying ability, but, I mean, I'm here now. <laughs> Damn it! They're shooting energetic eye boogers at me. I'll teach you to shoot your eye boogers at me! You've gotta be kidding me. Ah! It might be a bit easier doing the Mars combo, but I get a longer reach with this one. Which is kind of what I want. And my reward. Okay, I'll take it. And super resistant to fall down. Well,. In another video, I said that this guy got my vote for the most resistant to fall damage ever, but... I kind of forgot about Simon Belmont in the original game. That long... 
long corridor he falls down halfway in. So yeah. And she gets me again. Ooh, hard high, yeah. She also spits out those, so in case you really need to spam crosses like mad, you got that. There's one more thing, that itty bitty dot over there. I could have gotten this right after being Cerberus, and I'm thinking, is that thing in his- No, 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 there's this thing that appears in his room, and the Iron Golem's room, once you beat Camilla. Or Carmilla, or whatever the fuck her name is. Ah, fuck it, go up the other way. Yeah. This game has a similar to Castlevania 2 other than a flame whip and the Metroid setup. And that is this. There's a lot of super obscure bullshit that you're not gonna find at all on your own. You're gonna need to get the power. Nintendo power. And the thing that appears later in the game in the boss rooms for the Cerberus and the Iron Golem is a perfect illustration of that. Anyway, yeah, you think cause that barricade gets destroyed so soon after beating the boss in the chapel, whatever, uh, with some weird name, it starts with an A. You think you could go here next, but no, no, no. I'm sure some speedrunners can do it just fine, but... Jeez. You know, I'd love to watch a speedrun of someone just powering through this without getting the item from death. Ooh, I'll take it. Oh. Yeah, you don't want to fuck around with these guys. Damn it. You're supposed to be at level 40 before you face Camilla, but... I can do this shit with Diana Manticore and... Oh, turn back on. And I can always spam crosses, so I'm feeling confident. are gonna have to go after those things up here, because they have a card you want. I th and there's a room I can't get to, because these things are blocking the way. Yeah. When I said that the crates in Death's area were the only puzzles in the game, I kind of forgot about this shit. Do not want to get hit by that shit. See? Oh shit, oh. Mother. Pus. Bucket. Oh! Really? I just drop down here and suddenly it stops existing? stuff. Five bloody hits. At least I found something. And 
something that. Oh. oh, fuck you. Ah, oh, we gotta do this again. Twice in one video. Fine. Not cool. Not cool. Well, I guess technically it was, but... <sighs> Get over here. Star bracelet, okay. What's that about? Uh, my luck goes way down, but... All my other stats go way up. My strength goes way down, but... It boosts luck, so... Since it gives me an all-around boost in everything... I can always put the, ruck, uh, the luck ring on later when I really want to hunt for cards. Don't! Oh! sure they give you a card. How the hell am I supposed to get over there to that thing? Oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. Maybe there's one. Alright. Oh, come on. I gotta turn this off just to hit the damn thing. Also love how the water just stops as it's going on. <laughs> is if every water molecule in the fucking underground passageway says, whoa, 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 wait, wait, guys, just hold on real quick. Like, we gotta disobey the entire laws of physics because Nathan Graves just flipped a switch. Ooh, steel armor. You know... Oh, but intellect goes way down. Let's try it anyway. I do have that equipped now. Or... No, I didn't equip it. Still goes up quite enough. Alright, I think this is where I want to be. Oh, I mean, it's a few millimeters from his toes and it doesn't register as a hit. Someone's at the door and my brother's dumbass dog is going nuts! else in here? Whoa, yeah there is. Tricky Dicky. And of course no one's gonna bother just to shut that dog up. So now I can't bother to really say anything witty because that dumbass dog won't shut the fuck up. Hang on, guys, I gotta stop it real quick. <laughs> <laughs> 